Okay, look. I'm gonna say I'm sorry now for what happened up there, but I do not want you to take it as an admission of guilt. That distinction is important, because I don't think anything that I said was that off-base. Hey, I was just the girl on the sidewalk watching the car crash happen in slow motion. But you should nip it in the bud with Ren when we get back. Just say you're sorry. <sighs> Fine. For you, I will apologize to Ren when I see him. Look, uh, and I just want to clear the air too, just so Ren or whoever can't use it as ammo against me. But the whole I went to jail thing, I never went to jail, but I did beat up a guy and get sent to juvenile detention for it. And I just wanted you to know so it wasn't like a thing hanging over your head or anything. Why do you, um, why'd you do it? Just, my mom got sick and then she got real sick and then this kid, Timmy Finster, threw a baseball at my head and yes, he was joking, but I don't know, I just popped. Yeah, it was as stupid as it sounds and I'm not gonna defend myself. My mom found out, of course, and I never really squared it with her in a way that, I don't know, things never really work out the way you want, you know? But, whatever. Are you... are you okay? It's not like I'm sick or whatever, I'm fine. I'm not gonna say I'm a good guy, Alex. But I'm trying to be, and that's really about all I can say. You are a good guy, Jonas. I'm a scary judge of people. I'm like a bee. I can sense stuff. <laughs> but I'm serious now. You're a good guy. Okay? You are. I mean it. Okay, alright. I'm a good guy. Let's just move on. This is... I wanna... This is whatever, but are you, like, religious at all? I mean, my dad said your mom wasn't, but it doesn't necessarily... No, not at all. My parents weren't, and I'm not either. Okay, but still, even after tonight, this hasn't shaken anything loose or made you... made you sort of reconsider? No. I, I mean, we say they're ghosts. Unexplained phenomena? But when a bird looks in the mirror, she doesn't see her reflection. She sees, like, a bird assassin. And there's a strong possibility we're just as stupid right now. Huh. All right. Well, my mom was Methodist. My dad kind of didn't care, but tonight's kind of... I guess I'm just realizing a lot of it's rubbed off on me more than I thought. But I don't know. I was just wondering if you were. Well, what about it rubbed off on you? Is that... Oh my God, is that Clarissa? She's... Well, I was going to say okay, but... She's alive. You're... You're alive. Man, I've never been so happy to see you in my life. Oh, Jesus, she has the... she's doing the thing, the eye thing. Christ, this is not... I am not getting used to this, I'll be honest. Oh, God, not again. Uh, I hate when this happens. Maybe they want to... maybe the ghosts or whatever want to help us somehow? Is that the, like, point of trying to... trying to... whatever, like, talk through us or something? I guess. One way to find out. Clarissa, how are you, uh, doing, hun? Alex, a little help over here. Clarissa, why don't you crawl down from there, please? You think you can control me? 
Clarissa? I'm... I'm trying to help you. This is... this will... Help me? Help me? How will that help me? I was looking forward to seeing you. Yes, I used to dream about something like this. It, it's helped the others. Ren and Nona, they've gone through the same... Gone through what? Their children have gone through nothing. When you're off, the little machine has no more heart than a brain. No more heart. Man, Jonas, what... what was all that about? I don't know. Clarissa, are you all right? <sighs> Steady, just... just take it easy. I'm fine. I can... I'm fine. Okay, just take it slow. You've just... been through something. Do you remember anything that happened? I remember waiting in Fort Milner and seeing you. That's it? How did I get here? We... I think we were hoping you could tell us that, but I don't even know if it matters. You're here now. There's been, like, time disturbances or something, and I think that's what's been teleporting people around, so... And we just had one. Time disturbances? You really don't remember anything? No, I remember something. I remember you with that radio. And I remember feeling like you were the reason all of this was happening. Wait, it's Clarissa's turn already? Yeah, it's my turn. What do you mean, it's Clarissa's turn already? I haven't even asked one question. Everyone's asking me. I get to do the asking now. Are you... are you controlling this? It's, uh, my turn, if that's what you mean. And you, of all people, should know what my question is going to be, because I'm not going to waste it. Alex, what did you do? Explain why me and my best friend, and your idiot best friend, and your new step- Clarissa, please don't draw a chalk line here. Don't make factions, just... We have to stick together if we're gonna make it through this. Jonas, now you're seeing who you're stuck to until graduation. Clarissa, seriously, I can vouch for this. This isn't her fault. It has to be her fault. Of course it's her fault. There's no other way this story goes. Don't she listen to her, okay? She's pissed at the world, and she likes to take it out on me, and, and none of what's happening makes any sense anyway. I'm not. It's not no, a... No, come on, Clarissa. Let's not do this right You're now. You're gonna learn, Jonas. I swear to God. The town looks at her like she has a red letter tattooed on her frickin' Clarissa. forehead. And the giant, lit-up, Christmas tree reason why is that Michael is dead because of her. Because of her. Like... It would take a very sick person to see it that way, and I would love to hear the explanation. Michael was gonna leave town. He was free. He was out of here until this one convinced him to take her swimming for one last God knows what. And he drowned. He drowned in Horn Lake while this one could barely flap her arms. Clarissa. You weren't there. No one was there, so how the hell would you know? Everyone knows. Everyone knows the freak sister who let her brother die while she clung scared to the bowline. Okay, enough. Seriously. This is... Clarissa, this is so... I can't even believe we're talking about this right now. She is... Jonas, don't... Just don't think of me like... I don't. I won't. But right now, we're gonna break into that office, and we're gonna find the key. And we're going to go home. No. No? What do you mean, no? All the outs in free. So let's... Wait. What? Wasn't Clarissa with us like two seconds ago? That's crazy. She was... It was like she was just here. Did she run back to the gate? Oh, damn it. Yeah, she was just here. Wait, I'm getting... it's deja vu again. Are we... Yep, this isn't budging. Well, the lock looks, uh, less than modern. Let's just brute force it, both of us. It might splinter, but we should get in. Brute force it? What is that supposed to mean? Elbow grease, shoulder, lard. We're gonna break down the door, okay? Us, together. <laughs> All right, let's see if Ren's plan was a good one or not. Uh, I think here's something. It's another pocket radio, I think. But it's like there's way more stations on the dial. It says that... here's another one. It says they're wall radios. Wall stands for... Wave Assisted Lock. Ah, they use, um, that frequency thing, where each frequency is like a key to open the doors around here. It says that you use them like identification tags. It must work for the gate, too. Oh, wait, look at this. Personal effects of Margaret Dorothy Adler. Why would her stuff be here? Didn't her family, or, like, hasn't her family been carting her things back to town? We can head back. I'm just gonna... Here, this is... To whom?
It should concern. This is a letter from her? This island and its history is a lie. Wow. Well, this is going somewhere. What? What could that mean? I've been compelled by both forces outside my control and my own willful concern for the safety of others to conceal the many truths about Edwards Island. But now I feel any further inaction may carry a far greater risk. Forces outside our control? Like... like ghosts or the army or what was she talking about? I don't know. Inside, you'll find two wall-equipped radios. I have commandeered the old Cardinal Station 140.1 and used it to relay clues to nearby beacons buried throughout the area. Find these beacons in the notes within and discover the true chronicle of the island. Oh, scavenger hunt! Oh, scavenger hunt! Scavenger hunt! Wait! To whosoever finds the material know that I am discomfited for keeping it hidden and ashamed for the lies I helped preserve, but also know that I acted in what I felt were the best interests for all at the time. And truly, for the interest of time itself? And then oh, it... <laughs> I've had... Oh, I've seriously had, like, dreams about this. Finding a secret, digging it up, it turning out to be a mechanical unicorn. Please do not get glassy eyes over this, okay? You... We do not have to dig up some old lady's recycling. We can just go home. Everything becomes a... Alpha, November, Tango, India, Quebec, Uniform, Echo, eventually. Everything becomes a... Alex, why are you wearing that jacket? It's like 75 degrees. The sun's out, you know? But I thought you said you were gonna go swimming anyway. You bring a jacket, but you don't bring a swimsuit? The sun is not out. The sun is... I guess it barely came out just now. But see, this is when I get punished for watching the weatherman. He said it was gonna be like overcast. He said there was a chance for clouds. Hey, Michael, we didn't bring drinks. Did we? Wait, Michael? Uh, yeah? What is it? What? How? Why am I here? What? You don't want to hang out at the beach? There's stuff in town, but it's all boring knick-knack shops or whatever. No, I mean, I mean, why are you here? Why? Wait, am I supposed to be doing something right now? You gotta get your dad. I gotta get dad nightcrawlers from the shop. Yeah, but we're gonna do that on our way back. Where's, where's Jonas? Jonas? Who's Jonas? Is someone else coming? Yeah, is that a friend of yours? I just... <sighs> never mind, I guess. Okay, Clarissa, take a note. Remind me to check the yearbook for a Jonas, so I can make fun of Alex's secret boyfriend. <laughs> Noted. Today turned out to be... a flawless day. It really did. Yeah, no, it did. It really did. I wanted to bring a kite, but thought you'd laugh at me. Uh... Yeah, um, it really is kind of ideal, actually. Yeah, I'm like, right about to start sweating, but I'm not. No, it is perfect ice cream and tennis weather. It's been a spell since we did something, right? I feel like I haven't talked to you in a while. How have you been? What's been going on? How's classes? How's, what's his face, Mr. Collins' English? Truthfully, I've, um... I... Ah, sorry. I think... Yeah, I... <laughs> I accidentally left my phone on the ferry, because I do things like that. <laughs> oh god, you idiot. Go get it before it leaves. When I get back, I want to hear an Alex story. <laughs> well, can't I just come with you? I'll take two seconds. Think of something to tell me. So... Uh... <laughs> do you... Well, I guess you don't remember anything, right? 
What am I meant to remember? I'm sorry, did I forget something? I'm bad with... Uh, forget it. It's all right. Um, I'm glad we could all do stuff today. I'm glad you were cool with it, I mean. I know you guys are really close and like, I know it can be annoying when somebody starts keeping all their time for their girlfriend or whatever. So, I think it would be cool if we could like, continue to do things together. Clarissa, no, this, this is different. He's my brother. I've known him since I was born. He's not just a friend I'm losing. Yeah, I get that, I get that. And um, I'm sorry if you feel like you're losing him, because you're not. Michael, uh, he loves you, like, a lot. I'm sure you know that, but he talks about you all the time. <laughs> oh, Alex did this, and Alex let the frogs out in science class. Isn't she hilarious? Yeah, well, I love him too. I had to fight the skipper for it, but he didn't reckon how many squats I could do. What's it up to, six? Only on burrito days. On non-burrito days, it's like eight. Ah, oh, Jesus, thank God you're back. It's like an eternity sitting here with this one. <laughs> Thanks a lot. No, I know what she's talking about. Hey, I'm interesting, I'm entertaining. <laughs> thank you. So, I actually really want a cold something, so I'm gonna run into town and get like a soda. Anybody want anything? Um, no, nah, I'm good. No, thanks. I'll be back. Okay, I'm here. What's the story? I want the news. I want the Alex first edition. What's going on? I've missed you, man. I, I've just missed you a lot, that's all. Hey, come on. I've missed you, too. And I know I've been hanging out with Princess, but it's a two-way thing. You can knock on my door. We live in the same house. We gotta bring back movie night and board game night. <laughs> all the nights. Yeah, sure. And look, I know this was supposed to be our day. But I completely forgot I promised Clarissa I'd do something with her, so thanks for chaperoning. I know it's not what you had in mind, so... But I owe you. What do you see in her, really? Okay, here's... Okay, Tuesday night, she dragged me to a comedy club for open mic, shoved me on stage, and then proceeded to curse out the entire bar when they didn't laugh at my horrible jokes. And that was a Tuesday, so that's what I see in her. Yeah, I'm sorry, I just don't get it. It's important to me that you like Clarissa, Alex, so tell me the truth. What do you really think of her? Oh, God, do what you want, man. Don't ask me for advice. <laughs> okay, I'm taking that as endorsement, just so you know. You know, I never noticed. That's a good-looking jacket. I should ask for it back. I don't like my new one. Feels like I got shoes on my arms or something. <sighs> you know what, Bucko? I need it more than you. <laughs> Bucko? You haven't called me that in years. Alex, are you all right? <sighs> okay, uh, are you are you back? <laughs> You've been acting super weird for like the last five minutes. Do, do, do you know that? <sighs> I mean, I let it go for the first two, but... Jonas, I just saw... <sighs> I think I just saw my brother. Wait, what? Where? Here? Is he... D did you see him somewhere here? I, I was... It was like those time loops we've been experiencing, right? This was... It's like we've been having ripples, and this was a wave. I was bumped all the way back to when Michael was still alive. Just now? <laughs>